Hi, this is Tim Blanchett, owner of SCB Legal Doc Assist. We're a licensed and bonded legal document preparation service specialized in divorce. And today I want to talk to you about how to change uh, a spousal support order. And this can be either um, during your divorce process, it can be post judgment after the divorce has been finalized, it doesn't matter. Um, but I want to talk to you about what the court is going to look at as a reason why you can uh, make a request to change spousal support or modify spousal support as, as the court calls it. So the court says here, depending on the situation, either spouse uh, might need to change the amount of spousal or partner support that is to be paid. To ask for a change in the support amount, there needs to be a change in circumstances. So this is what you want to key in on here, change in circumstances. And what they're referring to is that something significant has changed since the spousal support order was made. They say here that maybe the spouse or partner was getting support, no longer needs it, or the person paying support has had a significant drop in income and can no longer afford the amount of support. Sometimes the support, the spouse getting the support is not making good faith effort to become self-supporting. So the paying spouse can ask the court to change or end the support order based on this. So just to recap that, there has to be a change in circumstances, and this is generally regarding money. Did one spouse lose a job and is now making no money? Did one spouse get a significant raise or a new job and is therefore making more money? Um, and that could be uh, on either spouse. So if you're the one receiving support and you received, you received a job and are, are earning more income, your spouse may um, file for a modification to reduce based on your new income. And the same can apply to them. If you're receiving the support and um, your spouse gets a increase in their job, you can go back to court and request a modification to increase uh, support. So you can modify it up, you can modify it down. The court's going to look for a change in circumstances. And of course, um, this is what would be done on a request for order, uh, previously known as an order to show cause, um, it's the FL 300, and there's some more forms you need if you are doing this post-judgment. As you see on your screen, they say the form FL 157. It basically uses a number of factors to help the court determine if they should grant the request for modification of support. If you're representing yourself and you're looking for an affordable way to get this change in spousal support, that is a service that we offer here. We can help you prepare the request for order. Um, we can help you prepare any supplemental uh, forms that are required, including your income and expense declaration, which is always required when you make some request regarding um, in regards to money. Uh, my name is Tim Blanchip, owner of FCB Legal Doc Assist. Uh, please give us a call if we could be helpful in changing your uh, spouse support and filing a motion on your behalf. or even responding to a motion if your spouse has filed a uh, request for modification of support and you need to respond, we can certainly help you with that as well. Please give us a call with any questions. Again, my name is Tim, 661-281-0266, and have a great day.